Welcome back to Factorial, folks. We are joined, as always, by ST Hedgehog. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. And it is great to be back. It, it is, yes. My apologies for um, us not having videos out for a while. It's uh, it's all down to me falling ill. And uh, difficult to record when you can't speak properly. So It is. Yeah. Very. It is. Um, uh However, I, I'm 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 at a point where I've come back down. I remember I was here making walls, and I have made walls. And now I don't remember what else I was doing here. Was I just making walls? <coughs> Are walls used in multiple places? Did we need them on the rail network? Uh, we do. Uh, they're used in uh, science. Okay, so I guess I'm putting a train session here. All right. Okay, let's do that, because that seems like a good enough thing to do. Uh, a pickup train. And I have our inserters here on a train. And I have filtered the train so that we have two stacks of burners, four of the regular ones, four long-handed, four fast, four filter, uh, four stack inserters, and two stack filter inserters, and then the rest is set to wooden chests right now because those are never going to be on a train. Okay, cool, cool, cool. So we kind of need we kind of need red circuits. Desperately. Okay. Uh, I thought there was a way to flip blueprints. I think that, I thought that was something they added. To flip them? Yeah. You can rotate them, but I don't think you can flip them. Um, mm, oh, well. No, that's fine. Uh, I'm I'm sure I've read somewhere that they they managed to flip blueprints, but it won't let you flip them if they are uh, um, if they contain like train things because that doesn't flip well. Okay. So maybe I'm wrong. Yeah. Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. Our ammo production here. Let's bring in the rail. I need to know where the rail is. Why is that cut off? Well, it's not. It's there, but why is, isn't it producing anything then? Come on, robots. Uh, I have managed to recover my gear. Into, well, I didn't recover my gear. I have built new gear. Um, so I now have uh, the capability. I have the technology. To carry on okay. moving. Uh, it was it was a bit of a pain. Uh, so where are see. all our copper plate trains? I do not know. Uh, let's see, copper plate pickup. We only have one. Then, uh, there it is. <laughs> yeah. Waiting at copper plate drop off. Over here. For the copper cables, okay. So, I think I need to make some more trains. I've got a load of copper plate on me for some bizarre reason. Oh, there was the thing with the trains as well. They changed it, so they won't go to a full station, right? Or a station that's already occupied or something. Uh, oh, um, yeah, you can set the priority on the trains, can't you? And I think I've set them all to two. Um, so it will request the train, and then the next train will come and park up and wait for it. Because if you set it to one... 
uh, we had the issue where all our trains were parked up. Yeah. Using up space because we didn't have a after parking bay, which is what we need, really. Because the, the two train stacking's fun. It, ta it takes, you know, it takes the trains out of the system, does it? But it does mean that if you're waiting a long time for one train to fill up, the second train is just sat there idle doing nothing. Yeah. So, really, it could do with having a parking after a train drop off uh, mm -hmm. for the trains to go and park and wait and then go to their destination. But, yeah. All right. Uh, I need some rails. I have rails uh, in the back of my train. So you ink. Oh, we Both need some engine units. We have engine units somewhere, don't we? Uh, I believe so. In the little boxes down by our old base. Yeah. Which, which I did return on the copper plate production down there just to try and get rid of that copper ore mine down the bottom. Okay. There's only a little bit there, so that's been re-enabled. But it's going to run out of coal, I think. Because it's just using up the coal that was left there. Not that I put a radar down to actually view it. But... Okay. Uh, let's see. Two of you. I'm going to need iron plate and gears. Let's see, where is the gear train? Is it up here? It is. Hopefully, you're going to make that. you down here for a second. Sorry? Hopefully, it's going to make belts. The gear train. <laughs> M maybe, uh, but I'm just stealing it for a second here. So I can make some oh, more cargo wagons. Oh, that was a mistake. I should have put just a long straight one in. Dole. Oh. Right. Oh, whatever. Whatever. Does it matter? Does it matter? Uh, so where do you set up the um, the priority thing? In the station itself. Click the station, and at the very top it says how many trains are allowed to come here. Uh, enable train limit. Yeah. For most drop-offs, it should really be one, I think. Mm-hmm. Um, but for the ore and stuff, it should be two. Okay. Then, for then, you don't, then you don't have to do the, the logic for it. Uh, well, it depends on how many trains we have to pick up, doesn't it? So. Um, yeah. I think really it's only effective for the ore, to be honest with you, because that's the only time we want the trains stacking out doing things. Because uh, for the pickups, you're, that's only the one pickup is what you're you're doing, if you know what I mean. Um, yeah, that's true. I don't see you on the map. Why don't I see you on the map? I'm over at the copper. Oh, there you are. You're, you're uh, fading into the red there. Um, yeah, the pickup should just be infinite because there's there's parking before it, isn't there? So yeah, they want as many trains as possible going to them. I did manage to make twenty four uh, production science packs. Oh, cool. Off camera. Uh, I just had stuff in boxes, and I was just like, what can I use that for? Make the science packs. Yeah. I'm just taking it done. <laughs> and now my inventory is once again full of Yeah, mine coal, too. Very full. Coal and stone furnaces and stuff. It's like, why? Why? That requires stone brick to make more of those. I make more of those. I don't, know if, I don't know if we need any more smelters, but... Uh, I think we're going to need more smelters. All right. Have 
some right. Oh, we'll stop. Drop oh. off. Full cargo. Empty cargo. Okay. Oh, and automatic. All right. So that's some more copper ore or copper plate trains, and we are now making ammo again. Good. Okay. How are you enjoying the uh, Dyson Sphere program? Uh, it's fantastic. I'm I'm loving it. L learning a new a new game. And yeah. I purposely try to not watch any more videos of it, so I do learn it myself and make mistakes and all that sort of jazz. Yeah. So um, it's very good. I'm I'm just starting a central bus system, mm -hmm. which I don't know is going to work or not in the game, but I'm giving it a go. Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, it's it's so cool, dude. guys. If you're not watching Dyson Sphere program, then go watch Dyson Sphere program because it, it is it awesome. Really is good. Yes. Yes, it really is a good a good game. It's just a new take on on the, the the only thing I don't like so far is the the poles of the planets are just, it, it um, just it's wrong. It's wrong. It just feels it feels wrong. Yeah, I, I I know what you mean. You know, as you as you go, you put down the foundation, and as you go all the way up, you end up putting down less foundation because the grid gets smaller. It's like. And I know yeah. why it gets smaller, but I don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but what bugs me uh, about them is the um, the shift in the grid. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. That is frustrating. All right. So. Maybe uh, do we have some grenades somewhere no, here? Stop. Not there. Okay, so... No one. No one. Uh, there are some. The 24. Woo. You're there. Okay. No grenades. No grenades. All right, fine. Uh, so I actually want to get rid of some of this stuff. I have way too much stuff on me. Uh, let's get rid of you. Let's get rid of uh, but I need some, some of you. Let's get rid of some of the coal. Not fast and serious. Let's get rid of you. Uh, no, not you. Ah, dang it. Uh, let's have a look at your rail blueprint book. What have we got in here? Stuff and things. Stuff and things? Stolen from the slipgator? Yep. I don't know. Yeah. Uh, uh, this many fast and served. Something like that. Get rid of you. Get rid of you. All right. That's and then I need some belts. Big to fear. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, I put this in the wrong place, haven't I? Yes, I have. Yes, I have. Mm. Okay, okay. Real yeah. quick. And we'll go over. So, a oh, I need some explosives. Of the cliff climb. Um, some cliff explosives. Yeah. 
Come on, train. You can do it. Thank you. Okay. And... Okay, so... So... Let's see, where can we build relatively safely? My train's run out of fuel. Oh no. Oh, right here, actually. Uh, are we making plastic? No. Okay. That was something I was going to do. Uh... In those boxes. Circuits? Pick up a wow. Let's okay. Stick. Up there. But I need explosives. Is there any explosives in the boxes near you? Um, I think there is actually. Cliff explosives. That's what I need. Yeah, I'll put that line in to fill up some boxes there with the copper, but I think they're full. Yeah. There's 186 in the network somewhere. There they are. Oh, there's some steel. Let's grab a bit of that. Let's get rid of those. And there is a uh, rubber port on the floor here. Which I can't pick up because I am full. Where? Right there. There. Huh. <laughs> I got it. I don't know why there's one there. Uh, let me put those in there. That will get our side now. for a bit. Yeah. Okay. So. Okay. Cold sweating petroleum gas. Since you've been doing all the oil stuff, I think I'll let you set up <laughs> plastic. Yep. Yeah, I can do that. I can do that. I was going to start batteries as well. Okay, sounds um, good. Because we need them for laser turrets. Yeah. Uh, but I want to just put in this wall thing to get it done. Otherwise, I, I forget again where I am and what I'm doing. <laughs> yeah. And not just in the game. Uh, <laughs> but... <laughs> <laughs> Uh, oh, we don't need red circuits for laser turrets. I thought we needed red circuits for laser turrets. No, no, they just need just just need batteries. Oh. Oh. I should do this as a straight line. That's what I should be doing. You know, I could do a pipe setup. A little pipe production line. That wouldn't be a bad thing. Uh, because I want to make engine units. Yep. Because I want uh, to make flamethrower charts. Ooh. Yeah, so with, let's play with fire, you might get burnt. Yep. I'm hoping to burn someone else. Not very friendly? Nope. But they've deserved it. Uh, let's just do pipe here. So this can go, this can go, this can go, this can go, this can go. Oh, we can blow up some cliffs. So. Uh, 
there. Okay. And there are basically no trees around here, which is wonderful. Can I insert construction is full? No. No. Um uh put those down there. So we have the inbound there. Straight lines in. Alright, so Wait, why won't it like that's awkward. Well, let's take a look at the rail blueprint book. What? Ooh. Wait, what? Why won't that Okay. I made that blue. Okay, so we need to yes, I destroy know. all that. Put it in there. there we go. It's not that much, to be honest. Uh, deconstruction planner. How did I make that so wrong? Oh, because it's ah, uh, yeah. I don't no, know. I know. I know why. I know why. Because I copied it on the vertical, and when you copy it on the vertical, it doesn't rotate to the horizontal properly. Whereas if you copy it on the uh -huh. horizontal, it does, which is just bananas. But nah, doesn't matter. Real blueprint book. T junction roundabout. Oh, I need to take this one up as well. Okay, but it does line up there. Right. I don't know whether I'm putting too many signals in or not enough or whatever now. I've lost track. <laughs> whatever. Too many signals is better than not enough. I think. Absolutely. So... Let's do that. Okay. And I've got to come like way out over here somewhere so I can put parking in for this thing. So, do I? I can just come off here. Done. Let's do that. That makes more sense. Okay. Then we need uh, I think we'll do. I don't think I'm going to make a, um, a parking lot here for, for, the, uh, for the pipes. I mean, one train in to drop off and one train in to pick up should be enough, right? I have no idea. Um, I... I mean, what do we need pipes for? I guess it'd be okay for, I mean... Now we do need engine units for some science, don't we? Uh, yeah, we do. See, we're coming in on there. So, I think it's this one I want. Mm, no, it isn't. 
apparently. Right, so... This one I want to make this a real pain. Oh, and it just fits. Beautiful. Nah, that'd be fine. That'd be fine. Uh, so, nah. Down trees. Two roller ports. Ah. Ah, no. No, 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 no. <laughs> Not what are you doing? I'm pressing X to delete stuff because it's a Dyson Sphere program. And uh yeah. and that shoots things. <laughs> 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 and I don't want to be shooting things, so yeah, no, that's 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 bad. Yeah, I, I keep trying to tilt the camera. Uh, I haven't done that. I haven't done that. I'm, 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 I must admit, I'm okay for that one. The 2D to 3D is fine for me. It's just the the press X to, to delete stuff. I, I need to just assign X to like a blueprint, a deleting blueprint, and then it's like, yeah, it works. Yeah. yeah. Just, just get job done. Work. Come on, guys, pick up the pace. Bump, bump, and bump. There we go. <laughs> and then we'd need one input and two outputs. So, because. Where are the pipes? Okay. Oh, I'm doing it again. I'm building a system that's not going to be expandable or isn't going to be able to have fuel added to it because <laughs> I need to do that. I must remember I need to do that. Okay. One sided reel. Although fuel can be added on a set. Drop. Belts. Oh, where do I think I want them? Yeah. Yeah, fuel can be added up there. That's fine. Okay. That's not a problem. All right. And one side wheel. Drop belts forward. There. Is this regular transport belt I have? Damn it. There it is. Well, you know what? Let's take this and say. Open it. I want to run. I well. want to upgrade items and entities. Yellow to red. There we go. Save. And then we can stick it on top. And can I? Input and input. Another input. Okay. That's better. Yeah, that'll work. And then I can put the fuel train up here. 
but I don't have any more. Uh, I need more uh, iron. Really? I need more iron? Wow. Okay. That's that's a new feeling. <laughs> Normally copper. No. That's from. I want belts from front. Well, a one-sided rail. Pick up belts. Um, okay, so we want to go down here, don't we? So let's put in that there. Front. Uh, oh, do we want to go up as well? Can we go up? Where? Yeah. Don't I have that? No, we can't go through there. One-sided rail. Pick up belts from front. Ooh. Yes, that's the one I want. I like that idea. So we'll go down and do that there. Okay. So I want to do a, uh, a T junction here. So we've got and options. That. Okay, and uh, I think so. That's all going in, and then we want the refueling stop. Okay. We're getting there. We're also out of time. Yes, we are. So, shall we call it here or? Uh, give me, give me a minute. Give me, give me a minute. I, I want to yeah. plug this in. Not, not that it's going to do anything because I haven't got any other chests or anything for this. But, um. Okay, there we go. So the stone wall is connected. Cool, cool. Well, the power system is... I don't know why it does that. Why, why, why do you do that? So I can make this... Uh, is it called stone? I'll just call it walls. Wall pick up spell with a crypt. And we'll, uh, I don't want to level train limit here, there's no point. There we go. Okay. So I need to go and get some bits and pieces to actually fill this out. But other than that, right. I'm happy. We're all done. Cool. So shall we call it here then? Yeah. Yeah. Alrighty. Then uh, thank you very much for watching, guys. We hope you enjoyed it. 
If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Have fun.